I'm Kevin Stone, orthopedic surgeon at the Stone Clinic. Today we're going to talk about CrossFit for high schoolers. What's happened over the last few years in high school students is, as you know, they have to be single sport athletes in order to make the team in high school or to be recruited for college. And unfortunately, that limits their athletic range of uh, motions, skills, mindset, all the things that the old three sport athletes had. Additionally, it puts a tremendous amount of strain on the same joints or the same muscles doing the same sport over and over again. CrossFit has come along and has really attracted a lot of attention and excitement amongst high school and college fitness coaches and trainers because it emphasizes the full 10 components of fitness, from strength and agility to power and coordination and accuracy. And it really has a healthy aspect to it as long as it is not overdone or overly competitive. And so we encourage our high school athletes to take on CrossFit type principles or to use a CrossFit gym to help augment the sport that they're playing or the sports that they're playing to see themselves as a total athlete, not just a single sport athlete. And CrossFit's probably the single most efficient time use for a high school student who's so busy with school and sports that there's very little else they can fit in. So we recommend our high school athletes think about that total fitness. CrossFit or other similar programs are a great way to do it and a great way to prevent injuries.